dust on the horizon. For Erwin Rommel, this was the familiar opening to a desert battle. But this time, something was wrong. The second warning was the speed. In November 1941, Rommel had prepared his Africa Corps for a slugging match against slow, heavy British tanks. What he got was a number 27 miles per hour and it blew a hole straight through his doctrine that he'd learned from past fights to counter British armour with layered anti-tank screens anchored by his deadly 88mm guns. His entire system was built to bleed an enemy who advanced at a walking pace. But these new shapes on the horizon weren't walking. They were crusaders, and they were moving faster than German gunners could track. Suddenly, Rommel's carefully laid traps were useless. The crusaders didn't smash through his lines. They simply went around them, covering ground in hours that his staff had calculated would take a full day. For the first time, speed had become a weapon pointed directly at Rommel.